So when it comes to missionary work, um, you know, I think the preach my gospel way is the best way. There's wonderful techniques and principles in there, and I think you should follow those. Um, I think in general, you know, each of each person's a little different, and so each people, each person will, each missionary will approach missionary work a little bit differently, um, and maybe even change their approaches throughout their mission. Um, so I don't know that there's any right, you know, way, but just some thoughts that come to mind of techniques or ways of doing missionary work that I thought were effective. Um, I think little things make a difference. Um, making the choice to talk with everyone on the street, that's a very small decision, but it can make a big difference throughout the course of your mission to really find elect people who are ready to hear um, at that point in time. Um, some other things, I think it's wonderful to go out with members. That's got to be one of the most fun parts of my mission, just like leaving with members and you know, going lesson to lesson. Uh, I've really enjoyed that. And even sometimes doing um, splits with members where, you know, my companion would go with, uh, you know, a priest or an elder and I'd go with another one and we'd go and we'd do twice as many visits, you know, in two hours do, you know, four or five visits instead of two visits. Um, that was really, really good. Um, uh, so as far as like, Entering houses, I don't think there's necessarily the right way. I've heard of wonderful converts who have been introduced by the into the gospel from missionaries who used a variety of different tactics to, uh, to approach them and start sharing the gospel with them. Um, we tried everything like under the sun with my companions, like um, you know, we tried super serious, super fun, super. Um, We'd sing songs to them in their doorway. We'd try all sorts of things. And um, one thing I, I found, I, I don't really know. I, I think the important thing with this is just to have the Spirit with you um, and to be prayerful about what you're doing. If you feel uncomfortable about what you're doing, how you're doing it, to, to not do it. Um, yeah, we, we tried all sorts of things. I, I think sometimes people, just in general, uh, I never was like a salesperson before my mission. Some missionaries were, and they felt more comfortable kind of entering doors, feeling, making other people feel more comfortable, letting them talk to them. Um, but um, sometimes if you can help them to feel comfortable, I think that makes a difference. Like if you can find something, you know, in their doorway or on their shirt or something, like find some sort of common ground and kind of break the ice that way. I think sometimes that can make it less awkward because for a lot of people it can be a little awkward to be approached at their door by two, you know, men from the United States or from wherever they're from. Um, so I think it's something to keep in mind. Like it might be worth trying, like to try to help people feel comfortable. Uh, at the same time, there'll be people who are ready to receive the gospel and like, you know, no matter how you approach them, it's more them like being ready and prepared by the Lord for the gospel. Not so much how you approach them that will make the difference. Um, so no, I don't have too much to say about that. Um, just uh, be prayerful about what you're doing. Uh, maybe experiment with respectful ways of doing missionary work. See what works for you, what feels good.